Hey y'all, we're over here one of our uh, jobs we just recently did, uh, and it's uh, on each side of the driveway. We did some landscaping uh, above some existing tie walls. So I'm gonna flip you around and see what that uh, result was. And I believe we'll have some uh, before pictures of this as well in the video, hopefully. So right now we uh, did some bouldering along this edge. Nice evergreen in there. It's actually a blue atlas, a dwarf blue atlas cedar. Did a bunch of perennials around the base here, uh, below these large oaks, and uh, some evergreens and other uh, perennials down here that'll really fill out this whole area. So you can see the oaks have been dropping, the acorns are crazy. Uh, so the bat's coming along pretty well. I'm gonna go up around the uh, front foundation of this house too, uh, off to the right, but I'll get this other side of the driveway. So some of the plants have been going through a little bit of stress, uh, which is typical when there's uh, drought well, drought like conditions like we've been having. So we've got a nice Japanese maple up at the top there. And uh, that existing lilac was there. Come up around the side here, follow that curve. That Japanese maple was there. Add some uh, boxwood, some grass there. There's a nice weeper there in the corner. It just kind of wraps around to the side. I'm going to get hit in the head with one of these. Uh, Acorns dropping. I'm trying to get around here. Perhaps on this upper side of the driveway. There's a nice little evergreen up against the boulder there. Coming up to that nice Japanese maple. It's a beautiful Japanese maple there. So yeah, that is what's going on at this site. We'll catch you later.